Call back in the earlier days, now the trunk of your car. This is where all of the equipment and all the spares were positioned. Now in the coach, and I know you can't see really close up, but just to try to explain a little bit about what is in the boot and what the judges are looking for to make sure that all the spares and all of the equipage is in a proper order, all shined and properly positioned. We have extra halters, lead shanks, there is a tool kit inside here as well as the uh, extra traces and we have the uh, water bucket and the uh, everything matches so the brake down and we have the extra extra bridle so again this is all and they have the uh, hole punch along the side and everything that is contained in the uh, trunk or the boot of the uh, vehicle has to be in order and this is part of the tradition dating back to the mid 1800s so it gives you a little idea what you might carry in the trunk of your car, you keep in mind, they, have to, they had to keep the equipment in here for four horses and a very large vehicle back in those earlier days. So the judges are examining what we see here in the arena and also inside where the paying customers paid a little extra to be inside and then again, more of course, the customers outside on the top. And we take a look at the course, our Groom and the scarlet coated guard, which we'll hear from in just a moment, making sure all is in order as well. So this is a very important examination and keeping up with the tradition of the sport of coaching. So we had a chance to see the uh, Yorkshire Hero, the Glen Wary entry, and a beautiful presentation here today, and you can give them a nice round of applause if you like. <laughs> 